Hello everybody, my name is Serena and welcome to episode 14 of our Battle Brothers Southern Mercenaries playthrough. We're looking pretty decent here. I want to get some more men so that we're topped off at the 12 minimum. And so I do want to kind of spend a decent amount. I know I'm not one for spending lots of money on characters or spending lots of money on anything, but um, I'm trying to get into that a little bit. Um, we're over here at Holschlag right now. It's nighttime. Let's go ahead and sleep until daytime so that we can see what they've got Whoa, along the road. A woman jumps out of the tree line beside the path. Oh, I've had I've had this one a couple of times. So either she helps us by giving us something or she robs us. I guess we could help her. Um Okay. Or neutral. Neutral is fine. I'm fine with neutral. But I've definitely gotten the instance where she robs us before and I'm glad that that didn't happen. Okay. So they've got some more difficult things. This guy is a little expensive for not leveling up. So I'm not going to get him. We'll take a look here. The quality wood's way too expensive. Holy shit, those are, those are some really expensive tools and supplies, so I'm going to pass on that as well. Uh, we don't have any of that stuff because I sold it all. Because we needed some money at the time. Um, let's go ahead and do this contract. Um, savages truly make I need you to get there and stop them. That's over 2,000 crowns. Four hundred in advance. Five hundred in advance. Move to the Oracle and defend it against Southern Heathens. Okay, so that's like a an actual like quest. Well, we got four hundred, so I'm gonna go ahead and say let's hire this guy. We'll see if he's good. He's not bad. He's not bad actually. Uh, we'll give him some okay weapons. Let's get him a helmet. If they have one for cheap. Oh. Oh. That is good as that's gonna get. I'm gonna put him over here, I guess. Cringe. Let's sell a couple more things though. Hold on, what don't I want? So we're gonna be fighting people. Oh, hold on, let's make sure everybody's got a sidearm. Since we've got a couple of them. Cool. Um, I always keep axes around just in case I end up having to fight the trees. <laughs> um, we don't really need this many spears, that's for sure. I just want to make sure that I have enough money to actually be able to hold up when I'm over there. Just under 900 should be okay. Move to the Oracle. Wasn't the Oracle, like, way down there? Yeah, okay. Got it. I guess we could cut through here, see how long that takes. Let's buy a thing of food. Uh, the cheapest one is berries. Okay. Yeah, okay, let's go through the mountains, see how bad that goes. How's this guy feeling? Still looking rough. That's okay. See if he's doing better now. No, absolutely not. <laughs> oh, okay. You can go around this way. Tools would really be helpful, but... Go in this way. Yeah. Oh. 
Oh, that makes me nervous. That's 10 undead. It's not really that many. It's doable. Though I would like it if they stopped chasing me. Alright. It's not as you last remember it. Many of the faithful have departed and the drums of war have come to the ancient temple's doorstep. Not that it matters. You've no visions to seek here. No dreams to unwind, only nightmares to provide your enemies. We will set up camp here. Um... Recruit some of the faithful. Okay, so we got a couple men to help us. Now we wait. Uh, against Southern, not the undead. Um... Take formation. Okay, so the undead are also going to be in this fight, I guess. So they've got some conscripts, some gunners, and an assassin. Alright, let's see how that goes. Not sure where the men that were supposed to help us are, but whatever. It's fine. 35. Nice hit. Okay, I'm going to move him up. Shield. You're going to wait. You're going to wait. You're going to wait. You're going to move up here. See if we can land a stun. Nope. Okay, he's going to move there. He's going to move there. He mm, no, I want them on the high ground. Shield. High ground. Shield. Move down. See if you can land a stun. Nope. And he's going to move here and shield. I have not fought an assassin before. It looks like they're pretty quick, which doesn't surprise me, uh, but it does make me nervous. Move him up here. Nice. Move him here. Good hit. Oh. Interesting. Okay. That kind of hurt, actually. Hmm. Move him up. Ow. The guns hurt. Damn. All right, let's see if we can land a headshot on either of these men. No? God, we suck. 62. Damn. A stun? Not a stun, we did hit him though. Uh, okay, it'd be cool if we could hit the assassin. Okay, I'm going to move him up. This probably isn't the best way to do it, but... Because now the assassin's got high ground and that's not great. Ow. Oh man, that was fire too. Literally. Okay, we hit the assassin. Damn. That's not fun. Okay, he's down. We're losing men left and right. This might be it, honestly. Yeah. This might be it. I don't want it to be, but it is entirely possible. He's going to try and run away, and he's going to get wrecked. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This is it. 
This is the end, friends. Of our southern mercenaries run through. I feel it in my bones. Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we've got the guy on the sidelines. Retreating's just not a good idea. There's literally undead right behind us. Yeah. No. I shouldn't have taken this quest. <laughs> it's fine. We had a great run through. I mean, we got a hundred and what, 20 days? It's gonna say that we still have a dude because he was on the sidelines. It was a disaster. But, I mean, he's level five. I'm just gonna go in and let him die. There's not co we're not coming back from this. Yeah. Eighteen points. I feel like that's really low. <laughs> well, <laughs> we tried. Thank you everybody for hanging out through this campaign. Next up is going to be Peasant Militia. I hope you're all as excited as I am. Um, we will be starting next Friday at 7 a.m. Uh, per usual. Uh, so we'll be starting with 12 poorly equipped peasants. Um, you can take up to 16 minutes once and have up to 25 in your roster. So it's going to be a bigger amount of people. But I can never hire anyone that isn't a peasant. But honestly, that's probably not that bad anyway, because I usually hire shitty people. Right? So, I mean, it is what it is. Have a fantastic rest of your week, everybody, and I will see you next Friday.